Meet Jack, a 61-year-old chef who has been cooking traditional Cantonese food for over 20 years. He owns a family-run Hong Kong-style restaurant with over 200 different items on the menu. And this is a day in his life. This video is sponsored by Squarespace. Jack wakes up at around 7.30 in the morning. Hi, good morning. He typically makes himself a cup of coffee and eats his breakfast on the way to work. So, what are we having for breakfast today? His typical breakfast consists of a boiled egg, some bread, and of course, his morning coffee. Jack arrives around 9 a.m. with his wife, who also helps out at the restaurant, and this is where our day begins. Okay, all right, so the chef has arrived already. We missed him totally. So we're on upstairs. But why am I doing all this? You see, I first stumbled upon Jack's restaurant during COVID when many small businesses were struggling. Well, the restaurant industry definitely took a large hit because of this virus. The biggest existential crisis that this industry has ever faced. For smaller and independent restaurants, this is simply a tidal wave. And at a time when restaurants were rapidly downscaling their menu due to a shortage of customers and staff, Jack was still able to serve over 200 dishes at his Hong Kong style diner with only the help of his wife and daughter. So. Naturally, I was curious to find out how he's able to serve so many different items on the menu, what his day looked like from morning to night, and whether or not I was able to survive a day in his life. Hello, good morning. Oh, you should talk. What are you doing now? Oh, you're going to prepare. Yeah, yeah. So right now the chef is doing prep work for the day, which includes stewing the soup, blanching noodles, cutting the veggies, and making sure everything is prepared in time for the lunch rush, which typically starts around noon. And with over 200 items on their menu, work is non-stop. Wow. The variety they offer is they just do a couple of ingredients and then they just do different combinations of them. It's been 13 minutes since I came here and it feels like he's done more than I've ever done in the kitchen. <laughs> in your entire life. In my entire life. And while everyone was busting their ass off, I was just standing there looking useless. Huh? So with my years of cooking experience on this channel, What are you doing? That is gonna go down as legendary. I decided to get to work. <laughs> Washing dishes. You, can, you, can, you, can. you gotta start somewhere, right? Oh, oh. So I can just wipe it like this, right? And as I'm washing the dishes from the morning prep, Jack fired up the walk in time for the lunch rush. You mean two hours is uh, a break? No break. In about 20 minutes, shit's about to go down. In the kitchen, I made the most of the food. It's the garlic and the onion. The chicken and the chicken. 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 It's 12 p.m. right now, just in time for the lunch rush, which is the busiest time of the day with over 100 hungry customers. There's a high school nearby which attracts a lot of students, workers who are taking their lunch break, and even longtime customers who make coming here a part of their daily routine. What brought you here today to Great Fountain? Because this is like a bit of a hole in the wall spot. Uh, my wife likes to come here. She's not here with me right now. She's uh, Mandarin Chinese. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah. Do you know how I speak Mandarin? Yi dian dian. How was that? Fresh, right? Perfectly cooked, always. Wow, look at that! It was a bit sloppy, but yeah, it's really, really good. <laughs> and how about you, Dad? Good. <laughs> He's like doing it. <laughs> face tells everything. I've been, I've been in, in here in this restaurant more than 20 years. Oh, I was, I was living not far from here almost every day. Oh, this is real nice. The service is fast. We got the typical broke boy uh, student meal three. Alright, so we got chicken, so like some sort of gravy. Spam, and then I don't usually put the broccoli in. Like they felt special today, so he put the broccoli in. No, but you gotta stay consistent, though. You gotta stay consistent because every day I'm consistent. Right. My whole life is consistent. Uh, everything I do. So usually right. as well with us, yeah. it will give us dinner as well if you we come here for oh, lunch. Really? Oh yeah, because, because the portion, right? Yeah, the portion. The so yeah. Big. For the price of this, I can get a Big Mac meal, but you know, of course, I'm gonna go with this, right? This something like this, say at another restaurant, will cost you around twenty-two, twenty-three dollars. This is at fourteen. This right here is only at eleven dollars. It comes with soup. It comes with a free drink, and then in this day and age, that's more than uh, what we're looking for. Exactly. Right? Exactly. 坐下来这个价格呢，如果我们上调一点的话，他们反应都很大，因为大家都很辛苦赚钱。
他们也是省着来花，我们也是看着这个市场去调调整这个价。送开来那些汤啊、饮品啊，都是送的嘛。但是我们是一路保持不变，大家都都辛苦，我们涨价，他们也也要付出更多嘛，对吧？对，也是不是那么好的事情。嗯，可以看到顾客的满意的面孔，就开心。We're gonna take a bit of a break. Now the crazy thing is, not one person in the kitchen right now has taken a break. Like I am, like kind of tired to be quite honest, and no one there has taken a break. Everybody is like extremely high energy levels. We're gonna eat up and then、uh, get back to work. And as the lunch rush starts to die down and hungry customers are enjoying their meals, Jack's afternoon is just getting started. 自己买回来的会新鲜一点。对对对对，是的。送来的不那么好，以前是送来的，但是我不喜欢，哦、后来我就自己去买了。现在你是几点、呃、休息啊？晚上，晚上，<笑>晚上啊！我每天在餐馆起码待十几个小时。就是他刚才说你是几点吃饭？四点啊，五点啊，这样这个时间吃饭，还、呃、员工还是轮着来吃饭，这个吃完。回来，另外一个车，这样每个人半个小时，半个小时吃饭。我是到最后嘛。All right, we're at the grocery store right now. We're doing a regular grocery run. We're gonna follow Chef in, help him do some grocery. 我来帮你，我来帮你推车。He's making a call right now to see what he has in stock, and then this is his boy. He's like, "Hey, bro, what's on the menu today?" Look at me. It's a plug. It's a plug. Plug, plug, plug. It's a plug. 我直接我给钥匙他，他帮我送上车来。哦哦，真的。So the chef here is so special that he gave him his car keys, and then the the the, the chicken legs are going to magically appear in his car. Head to the entrance room. Ah, you can go. I can go. Oh, really? Really? All right. So chef is right now in the back. I've never been to the booth of the grocery store, man. This is like the VIP only area. And after a quick grocery store run, it was time to head back to the restaurant and get to work. 那周一下班时候你喜欢干什么？去也是去买东西啊啊，<笑>去办货、啊、哦，也是上班的，差不多了。但是你不上班的时候，喜欢去钓鱼，钓鱼，钓鱼，然后钓鱼，然后也把鱼做了，也是像上班一样。<笑><笑> At two o'clock, I've been promoted from dishwasher to long bean cutter. Yo, this is fucking tedious work. This is hard work, bro. But you know what is not hard? Making a website with Squarespace. Now I know you guys heard this a million times before, but Squarespace supports our channel financially and makes all these videos possible. But do you know what else they make possible? That's right, making a beautiful website. For example, let's say you want to make a website with your own product, like how we did with our product, My Mom's Chili. It's simple. You start by picking a template, adding some graphics, your products, and there you have it. Your very own beautiful website for your amazing product. It's really that easy. And、now that you've got your online store, you need a way to communicate with your audience for important news and events. That's why I've been using Squarespace's email campaign feature. You can introduce your brand to new subscribers with welcome emails and updates, and also keep track of all your analytics on the back. And now to really build that community, you can even use Squarespace to engage with your audience. Just set up a blog page where you can chat with your amazing fans and keep them up to date on everything new. Now I know this all sounds too good to be true, so that's why I got you guys, the Ehe Gang, a free two-week trial, so you can try out Squarespace risk-free. But not only that, you'll be able to save 10% on your future subscription if you continue using it after the trial. So go make that dream come true and make your website with Squarespace today. Just use our link in the description box below to get started. Now back to the video. It's currently a little past 4 p.m. and the chef is about to take his very first break of the day, which happens to be his lunch. 吃完就睡觉，就睡觉了。有有时候一边吃一边睡，一边<笑>梦里一边做梦一边吃饭，<笑>对,对,对,对,对,对,对,对对对对。And one thing I wanted to ask him is why is there over 200 items on the menu? Now to give you some perspective, an average restaurant has about eight items on their menu, which requires seven to nine staff members. An average chain fast food restaurant has an average of 135 items with 10 to 15 staff members. Now, the Great Fountain Restaurant has over 200 items on their menu with only four to five staff members. Why do you have so many dishes on your menu? Because our menu is so many, it's actually just a few dishes, like a combination, so it becomes very big. Don't bring anything to eat, so it's a lot. It was evident to me at this point that Jack isn't here to maximize profits, but rather every decision he makes stems from the customer's needs. 
一点点。Finished lunch. It was a really good talk.、Uh, we're gonna head down and we're gonna take a nap. It's about 4:55, almost 5 o'clock, and this is when chef has a little bit of time for himself to rest. And since the restaurant's a little bit small, he typically takes a nap in his car. Can you think maybe we can use it for something? Just like that. Let you open the door. And then we're gonna go take a nap in our car too. Take a nap, bro. I got 15 minutes. The time has started already. I gotta go quick. Fifteen minutes later. So early, bro. Very good nap. Now it's five o'clock. Ten o'clock. Ten o'clock. Now what are you doing? Lunch. 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 Maybe I should order one of these for dinner.、Yeah. Eat my own. Yeah, you can fresh, fresh. <laughs> yeah. 进到里边去，你就知道每一行都是很辛苦的。是的，是的，是的。没有容易的。你做这个拍，你也辛苦啊。我看到你也很辛苦。还可以，还可以。<笑>不一样的辛苦，对对啊，因为你要得体验生活啊。对对对对，你熟了，知道的多一点。对对对，吃的苦才，你你以后才感觉到生活的充实，这是真的。你不付出，你不会得到什么，就是暂时得到也是不会长久的。但是你平时工作下来日积日月累，这样下来的东西你，你都是你自己的。So the Great Fountain closes at around 9 p.m., but the job isn't finished yet. They got to do a lot of cleaning, some prep for the next day, and then finally close the gates. As you can see, basically every other store here is closed. First to get up, last to leave. Oh, now it's time to close the gates. Hmm. One day, almost done with the house, right? You're at nine o'clock. Almost. 呃，九点钟关门呢，这些东西都收起来，嗯，然后 clean up 啊，有时候我要打那个锁匙嘛。And after spending 12 hours working with Jack, I wanted to ask him one last question. So what keeps you going every day? 要有一要有一个寄托、啊，生活要有寄托、啊，要有充实感。我做这个每天都觉得很充实。And、holding it over, and we are closing. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to click here to watch the chef try American Chinese food for the first time, and click here if you're a Cantonese speaker that wants to learn some Mandarin. Peace. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye.